We do a lot of confiscations with Florida Fish and Wildlife, USDA Federal, USDA State. Some of our vets even call us if there's animals that they find if they go into a home and see that there's something that has been left behind because somebody left. But uh, every animal here has a story to them. My husband and his father, again, started it 33 years ago. His father passed away in 83. He passed away in 05. So it's myself and my volunteers only that are running this place. I have about 35 volunteers. Nobody gets paid. Everything, they come in here, they do it, heart and soul. Oh, goodness, look at this. Oh, oh a chicken oh, wing. Oh, a chicken wing. Oh, a nice size. Oh, boy. Oh, right. Now, leopards, just like any of the other big cats, anything over 10 years old is considered old. I have a pup because she was so overweight with the fact that she was only getting her now, my mom. That's our mom. Okay. <laughs> now you look at the paws, I mean, you see how big, even for a runt that he's supposed to be, he's still... Now, normally he only likes big stuff, he likes hogs, he likes bigger meat. I don't know if he'll eat those or not, but come on. <laughs> But if you can hear the crunching, you, you, you always thank God that it's not your fingers. <laughs> but we have automatic watering systems for all our animals. It takes them. Um Eight tents out. By morning time, there was only three left. <laughs> so, and they said that the whole night terrified them. Now we had the Girl Scouts out. Where? About 10 tents were up and 10 tents were there in the morning time. <laughs> like, good girl. They look real young. Now, Raji, actually, you can tell with her nose, you see, I don't know, but the nose, like, you see the nose, if it was all pink, it's usually four years and under. If it's, if she starts to have spots, just like she has spots, you're talking five, six, ten. Now, she is actually about 12 years old. You, you know, you want this? There you go. This is a treat. You're getting fed later. But this is a Bengal tiger. Bengal females will range anywhere from about 250, usually tops at 300 if even, and usually around 250. The males will go about 500, whereas your Siberians, the females will go about 500 and your males will go over 800 pounds. They're tree dwellers. They like to be up, in, up high up. And he's about, this uh, owner passed away. Hector is over 15 years old. Wow. She said a combination of a bear and a cat. Does that mean well, that they bred no. somewhere? That's just how they got their name, is it because their fur is like a bear, their whiskers and all that is like yeah. like. It's called a caracal. They're related to oh, the okay. African serval as well. Charlie, come here, come here. Come here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No. 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 <laughs> Too much, Jack. I'll do what I want. Oh, hey, it's one thing. This is a white tiger. White tigers. Oh, oh. 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 He's a Bengal tiger. They white tigers are known to kill more people in captivity than any tiger there is. My vet tells me, the one from Switzerland said he's done twenty something surgeries on the big cats like this. So there's something that is genetically wrong with their teeth that goes into the brain with the nerves. So that's why they start to one try to kill somebody. Now you'll see sores on his elbows, it's just like us when we get you know, oh yeah, we're callous. Oh, this is a perfect picture. And she's like, you gotta do this cool. I had somebody else do this cool.
He looks like a, not an American bear. He looks like a Baloo is a Himalayan black bear. Mm -hmm. Baloo? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're going to get to go. Okay, I thought it was yeah. a bear. No, it was a baboon. Why did they do the lobotomy on it? Well, because it was, they had a bunch of men in the family and they didn't want him to compete. When we got them, their digestive systems were not never developed because they never had meat. So Lori had to gradually introduce them um, to meat, and it was ground beef. Ground Go on. They had no windows, no nothing. Oh, it's a big are. box truck that yeah. they were kept in. And um, all that they were fed was uh, one cup of dog food a day and marshmallows. Oh, oh God. No wonder she doesn't eat the marshmallows. Haley, I'm sorry. <laughs> She's going to have nightmares tonight. <laughs> So when we... Yes, I'm going to give you some. You know it. You know it. Yeah. Now, like I said, they were used. Squiggy does love. I know. Okay. Now, you don't, you don't have to do anything to get these. You know that. We don't make them do anything for food. But he does, he does the love sign. <laughs> you are a sweetheart. These guys were used in commercials, and like I said before, they were beaten with pipes. He's going to get mad at me if I don't keep giving them to him. <laughs> Stay here. He, what, he gave me one of these before. You get a little aggressive. Yes, you do. But he's the sweetest guy. I know. I know. It's from the wild. Okay. None of our animals have ever been in the wild. Okay, so no, no injured animals at, at, at well, rehabilitation? You know, or? We will.